engineer 775 here um, just doing a little test with a ram pump a lot of people asked um, what about freezing and what am I looking at I'm looking at my cattle tank it is uh, full of water and you can see the, the ram pushing the water in and uh, I'm just doing a little test because it's been pretty cold the last couple of days here uh, their normal spring gravity fed uh, water system is frozen up and probably there's about an inch of ice in there so this was a good test these last couple of days a lot of people asked this question so the proof is the water sitting is an inch thick <laughs> and the water being rammed up the hill is uh, just nice the cows appreciate it they can come over here and drink um, and without waiting for the ice to thaw or for me to come bust the ice so this is just a thing I do on the farm with the ram pump in the winter and my, you'll see my you see my ram it's exposed to the elements but with the water moving and hammering and I do check it on real cold nights just to make sure it's, everything's working fine on it I think you can see the flow of the water on the video and uh, have it returning too so anyway that's uh, what I do in the winter with the ram even when it's cold I let it run and between the hammering and the flow it doesn't freeze now I'm not saying that won't happen in your neck of the woods but uh, there's the comparison no water fighting that possibly breaking pipes compared to that nice uh, relatively warm water for the cows to drink uh, warm water and then I'm pulling it out of the bottom of a out of the pond so a little geothermal and then pumping it up that's eh, probably I need to put a gauge on that it's probably 50 55 degrees and uh, so anyhow just something the uh, benefit of the hydraulic ram and I don't have mine covered which I'm going to show you okay an engineer 775 down here at the ram pump on a icy morning see the nice ice sculptures that the rams making here and there's ice on everything but uh, not a problem with the ram ram's been running oh, it's been running for about a week just let it go sometimes I shut it off and uh, but on a cold night like last night the last couple of nights down in the teens 14 15 degrees or maybe even lower this thing just and that water moving like that doesn't freeze and then the cows um, always have water and so I just want to let you know because a lot of people have asked about freeze protection you can cover the rim and build a nice little house for it um, you know colder climates you might want to do that but I have found with the hammering effect and uh, the flow of water that mine won't freeze up but I do check on really cold nights up and coming I do check to make sure everything's adjusted that it's running nice like it is now and uh, have a pretty good flow I got the counterweight set in the middle so it's not pumping all that it could but I didn't I want to make sure it was ramming pretty hard so it would bust through any ice so it's the ram icebreaker and I guess that's it I hope that answers your question about what you can and what you can't do now I usually well I have some exposed lines here too just to prove to you these aren't even buried just one at one uh, one inch ram delivery pipe is not even buried it's just exposed and it was I think 14 degrees here this morning last couple of days have been nice and cold and uh, that's fine so I hope that answers your question yes you can run the ram but you better run it if it stops for any reason in the night you're gonna have busted pipes so make sure you know how to keep it adjusted make sure it's been running you know pretty consistently before you do this test don't fire it up start it up and walk away make sure that you've got a few hours of uh, it running they're finicky sometimes make sure your pressures and all the air and everything's out of the line and that it's functioning right before you do this on a cold night otherwise I advise you to drain it it's very easy to do I just shut a couple valves off and drain the lines down it doesn't take long to do that but uh, you see the benefit of having a tank full of water without any ice on it on a, on a cold morning. Alright, thanks for watching.